Are you kidding me? I haven't even started. Sorry to leave you on such short notice, Louisa, but I'm sure that Vice Principal Reigns will be able to handle things until the new principal arrives. Do you know what he's like? The new principal, I mean. Oh, uh, well, I have his file right here. Why don't we just take a quick look and see? Ooh, seems to be the young maverick type. The last school he went to, he arrived one week early, just to snoop around the place. So young looking. Could pass for one of the students. How can Miss Noble stand that chunk for more than five seconds? Love is a biochemical aberration, Danny. It does weird things to people. It makes them do things they later regret. You know what I'm saying, Danny? He's out of here, Lloyd. I've already got it figured. Oh, what are you gonna do? And how many detentions is it gonna cost us? I'm gonna get him fired. Oh, I see we're talking prison time here. And how do you plan on getting him fired? Just watch me. Line up! You got a social malfunction? You like to create a tension, is that it? Yes, sir, I believe I do, sir. You. What's wrong with this picture? Sir, a well laundered regulation uniform must be worn at all times, sir. Footwear? White athletic shoes and white cotton or cotton polyester blend athletic socks. Socks with colored rings are not acceptable, sir. See, he knows the rules. But you, you got a memory problem, don't you, mister? Yes, sir, I've got a severe memory problem, sir. And what did you forget to do? Forgot to put on my white athletic shoes and white cotton or cotton polyester blend athletic socks, Mr. Kelton, sir. You messing with me, punk? Apparently I am, sir. You asking for it, O'Neill, huh? You want me to jack your jaw? Is that what you want? Yes, sir. I suppose I've got it coming, sir. You'd like that, wouldn't you, huh? Get fired over a punk like you? Not a chance. Down, give me 50. Everybody else, laps. Hit it! Danny, honey, here are the house instructions, uh, all written down here on the checklist. Now you have the alarm codes, the plant watering schedule, all the emergency numbers, the hotel number where we're going to be staying, and um, Danny, you're not listening to me, are you? Plants, alarms, hotels, check. Danny's a big guy. He can handle a few days on his own. Don't worry about me. What could happen in a week? Well, you know, Lloyd's aunt and uncle, they are so kind in offering to watch out for you. Yeah, they're right next door. Now, you run into a problem, you just give them a holler. Don't you think we're too old to be doing this, May? Oh, Herb, we've walked across this driveway a hundred times. I didn't mean doing this. I mean looking after two 14-year-old kids. They're young and full of energy. We're old and full of cholesterol. Oh, I know, dear, but it's only for a few days. And they'll keep each other out of trouble. And after all, we've got to be good neighbors. I hate being good neighbors. Yoo May, sir, come on in. Yeah, I thought I'd return your bag. You might use it on your trip, you know, to pack things they in. They know how to use luggage, May. Well, thank you, really. Um... Oh, yeah, that reminds me. Danny, the mad genius, said he needs you to help him with one of his contraptions. Right. Oh, Danny! Danny, I've done it. I've solved the radio infraction problem. This is the end of world hunger for sure. Are we gonna blow up more goo? Come on. You have to stand at least 10 feet away. No, come on, make it 12.
It tastes like a real tomato. Lloyd, this is amazing. You made a big ripe tomato from a scrawny little seed in 15 seconds. Do you know what this means? The end of world hunger and riches beyond my wildest imagination. Lloyd. My face on the cover of Time magazine, Newsweek, Omni, Tiger Beat. I'll be a teen idol. Lloyd. I'll be a sensation, the first teen idol to win a Nobel Prize. Oh, but I can't tell anybody yet, no? I'm just a kid, they'll steal it from me, you know? I, I, I gotta think this out. Lloyd. Huh? This thing here, it makes things grow faster, right? Yeah. You see, it accelerates the biological growth processes through a resonant harmonic molecular stimulation. Right. So let's say, for instance, if I were to put a baby mouse in there, would it turn into an older mouse real quick? Well, yeah. I mean, the principle's the same. So would it even work on something big, like, let's say, a duck or pig? Well, yeah. You see, then, then if maybe you even had, say, a voluntary human subject at some point, you can make him older by, say, oh, five or ten years? Well, yeah. Well, I mean, it would take a more intense power output, but, but that's easily. Oh, no. No, Danny, forget it. No, no, no. I am not doing that. But it's perfect. If I were older, I could convince Miss Noble of marrying Jack Joe Kelton. <sighs> Danny, it's untested. I mean, there could be biomolecular mutations. Just five or ten years older. There could be incompatible tissue growth rates. You know, you could end up looking like the elephant man. But this is the perfect plan. You make me an old guy for a few hours, I'll convince Miss Noble to dump Kelton, then you turn me back into being 14 again. Danny, I have been working on this machine for almost a year. It's my ticket to independence. It means no more living with relatives who don't really want me. No more being shipped around from Uncle Harry to Aunt Myrtle to, to cousin what's-her-name down in Louisiana who never even heard of me. I don't want to blow it, Danny. Okay, Lloyd. You're right. I'll think of something else. You gotta ride this love thing out, Danny. Just go upstairs and watch TV for a couple hours. Take a cold shower, floss your teeth, anything. Just, just get your mind off it. Bachelor number two. What would you do if we were out on a date and a tall, dark, and handsome stranger swept me out of your arms and kissed me? That's easy. I'd have to, uh, jack his jaw. Well, I'd have to say well-laundered white cotton or cotton polyester blend athletic socks. And he said well-laundered white cotton cotton polyester blend athletic socks. <laughs> Perfect. Boy and Peggy, we here at the new Newlywed Game wish you two kids all the luck in the world. And we know in our hearts that you two will be happy and together forever. Forever. Together. Forever. Together. 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 Together